Hello everybody, welcome, welcome back to more Legend of Bumbo. I think I, I might have said Bumbo the Stout, but let's, I, I want to do Bumbo the Nimble because I want to see the new zone we unlocked. I think Bumbo the Nimble can get really, really strong with a couple minor changes. You know, we, we kind of learned, it seems like this character is, uh, it's got some, some rough stuff to start. Like, the first few turns are kind of not the best. But then after that, you can, uh, you know, you can start to pop off. That being said, I feel like this is not a bad idea. We're kind of lining up our, uh, our yellow mana, too. So we can do a little bit of it. poking and prod. And can we get... We can do this to do what is currently one damage. Oh! We crit. I guess we crit. Fantastic. I got no problem with that. In fact, like, why on earth would I have a problem with that? Could even remove a single tile. I really do, uh, I really do love that. Can we possibly kill? Well, I mean, we could crit. If it could happen on anybody, it would happen on this character. I just, I didn't, didn't quite think so. Might as well do this, though. We got a guaranteed kill next turn with the bones lined up. I just nothing matter. We got we got him booged up. Sometimes you just don't gotta sweat it, my friends. Sometimes you just don't gotta sweat it. So what item? Hurts an enemy that hits you. Destroy a column of tiles. Hurts an enemy that hits you. I mean I I just don't know about I, I don't know about those items you never really with such minimal amount of HP oh my god this sucks they're all just they're all just right there for us okay great uh, they're all gonna get prepped I figure you know let's let's do this I guess I don't like it I don't like it destroy a column Hell yeah. So we just want to make it so we can actually hit everybody. He's going to move up. We probably should have done one of those, actually, though. Would have been wiser. Ooh, baby. We can do this, and then we can even do that. We get two moves. This destroy a column is really, really coming in handy. We could put down the poo blockade. I, I don't know. Can we line up? We could line up an actual just attack, I, I guess, you know, keep one out of the way. And we get a nice, well, since we accidentally put that down, we might as well put the other thing down. Womp. And then, wow. All right. Things are going well. The destroy a column. Good, really good first item. Okay, you gotta go. You, you, you gotta go. So if we line up this and that, it puts the yellow mana in a slightly better spot. I don't know. Eh. Not great. I'm trying to see. We want to, obviously, like, yellow mana is the best thing. Uh, let's break this row because there's no yellow mana or bones. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. So we could obviously bone attack. We could also do this, which is, I think, a smarter idea, because then we can start getting it boosted. If we do that, the next turn we get... Oh, I don't know. If we, do, if we move that up there, we can go womp, womp. And then next turn we would get this. We could KO one of these. And then have one move left. Um, so where does th this put that black tooth? Where does that put the black tooth? Because if we do this. Oops. If we do that. Oh, gosh. I don't know. I just I feel like there's something else we can line up better. There's a lot of options. 
put that there. Would that help us anywhere? Not really. I just... This is a tough one. This is a tough one. We could obviously just booger him. Let's do that. It's... We don't always have to go for the big boy move, you know? We can do a... Clean, easy papoo. Papoo block right there. Can we line up the yellow mana? We cannot line up the yellow mana. This helps us with lining up the yellow mana on the next... No, it doesn't. Next turn, he was going to say. Hmm. This means we could get a five hit, which is actually pretty decent because then we get enough mana to maybe even do this. So to, we could do it three times. Feels like it could be done better, though. Because he can. It's fine. It's kind of fine, but it's also like really not. When you say it's fine, but you're not actually fine. We're going to take a hit here, because I... Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't the play. I don't think it was the play. we got to be able to line something up, though. One, two, three. We can booger. Or even better yet, we could do that. We could get a booger with for one. And then, then we got the yellow mana. Hell yeah. That's great. Fantastic. We can do one, two, one, two, and three. Ooh, baby. Three whole moves now. All right. So we could... One, two, three. One, two, three. We get two two throws and a, and a yellow mana poke. It's just that easy. It's just that easy. Still no damage. Thank the heavens. Destroys a tile plus mana. Plus three movement and random mana. That sounds fantastic to have for, like, boss setups. And if we could, like, lower the cooldown of that, that'd be fantastic. Yeah, I think, uh... Just setting up for the boss seems like a good idea. What happens if we do that? It's pretty good. All right. It's a lot of moves to do something that's only, like, kind of good. But we get to do that. And we have a lot of mana stocked up. We just we just need to eventually get that. Oh, boy. I don't know. I kind of regret it. I think it was maybe too many moves. But we do have three moves left, so who cares, I guess? Because we need to get that stacked up. That's the, that's the way we're going to get him out of here. Just trying to figure out where to put which bone to line up. What gives us the best situation with, like, the black teeth, I guess? None of those are good. We'll just... We'll do it anyway. Maybe a black tooth will line up. Well, we got lucky. Hell yeah. Okay. Womp. We could even get a crit at some point. This gains us mana. We could actually even... There we go. Wombo. Get another one of them. How much mana we got for yellow? None. This will line up so many yellow <laughs> yellow mana, though. Pretty darn slick. We could destroy a column there. Oh, it just keeps getting better. He just He's never going to stop. He's just never going to stop. Destroy a column. Is there anywhere we could... I mean, obviously, we got the... We can line that up easy. Uh, get, get a blockade, but I kind of we don't need to right now Removing a single tile. Is there anywhere we could get something magic for that? I mean we could do one move Nets us another uh, Mana to poke and prod with we are up to nine there All right, just gotta be yet another thing we can do Yep, we can do that for free. Wah. And then I am honestly just going <laughs> to... 
Woohoo! Keep going because he can't be stopped. Need I remind you, this is our first turn. Holy crap. I can't believe it. The poor guy didn't even get a move. He didn't even get to move. You know how I said before, like last episode, I feel like I had the cleanest first floor ever or something. Enemies may take damage moving. Oh, please. Please. All right. Spell costless, spell chargeless. Spell costless. It's... Uh... It's tough, because I want to make it so I can use the battery more. If I could use it every single room... Oh my god, an extra movement is so good. This is just too important. That is so, so, so important. Being able to do that very often, like, a lot, makes it just so we can stack up to ridiculous levels so fast. That being said, I hate these guys so much. One, two, three. Five should get us a KO on him at the very least, though. And we can poke and prod. We can do it three times. Kind of see like a little bit of a setup for next turn. Just seems like a big deal. For one, two, we gain an extra movement there. And we get all kinds of this, which doesn't actually help us that much. That being said, I'm going to do this because we're going to get the destroy column mana and we might crit. Uh, if we did, that would be great. We don't have. We do obviously one, two. But then we're in a situation where we're truly at one. Wait, one, two, three. But then we're truly at the whim of uh, removing a single tile in columns, which you know we could probably be okay with. I bet you we could make it happen. Truly, I guess we should just do this and cover our butt a little bit. Yeah, we'll cover our butt. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Then we can even do one, and it's good because he'll resist the first one. And then he'll take the damage here, and then he'll die. It's just that easy. We only got one guy. We didn't even need to put down the poo blockade. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? I don't want, I kind of want to like line up the booger. I just see if. The five, five block there. Good deal. Two boogers. We should be completely fine. I just can't see a situation where we take damage at this point. One, two, three. Should be three damage. Bye bye. Bye bye. All right. Blocks next. Attack and attacks. Hits front row enemies and pushes. Hits front row enemy and pushes. Both of these are good. This one seems broken though. From what I when I've had it, it just seems broken. They all need to be killed at the same time, so I guess we should get, just go for the flies. Okay. But I mean, I guess we can't. Can't only go for the flies, I suppose. That'll stop him from being able to do something to me, though, I guess. Which is super useful. Calm. Anything, anything that can be lined up. I mean, I feel like maybe get some yellow mana if we're lucky there. 
There we go. We got a blockade. Definitely seems like we should line it up down the center. Can hit the fly. Doesn't matter. The, the stacking and everything just doesn't matter for us. Okay. Bone mana is going to be great for us. We got the blockade. Thank God. Do one. Just doesn't. Does that help us in any way? Can we get. Um. Nah, we're fine. We get, we get the two bones we can throw. Throw. The fact that he's. That guy's sitting back there blocked behind that thing is definitely a little. Stanky. But oh well. Alright. So now we can poke and prod like crazy. So here we go. Remove a single time. We get another attack right here. If we're lucky, it's, it takes a whole extra hit. It's just. Yikes. So much. So much. If we poke that down, we could get... Oh, my God. We could get so lucky is what I was going to say. All right. We're great. Read of the God here. God. Wow. Yeah, Bumbo the Nimble is pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. This is... See, this is a rough, rough room to the point where I'm considering doing this. I'm considering it. Let's see what we can... Let's see what we can line up. Thankfully, we got these guys to... Uh, we don't want to hit the big boys yet. Okay. This will give us all kinds of... Uh, yeah, movement manipulation, everything like that. Oh, we have so much. So much we can do. <laughs> destroy a column. Actually, if we just destroy this column, we're good. We do that and that. Love it. And then we can even remove a single tile here. We can even get an extra attack, and it just keeps happening. We crit. We crit. Oh my god. Okay, one move left. Let's kill the fly. Yeah, I don't think we need to do that extra movement battery. See, everything seems to be going just freaking fine here. Uh, we can destroy columns still. We can remove all kinds of single tiles. Single tile, single tile. Put down a blockade. God, it's too much. It's just too much. He can't keep getting away with it. He can't keep getting away with it. We can put up a poo blockade. Real easy. Is it enough? I mean, we could also... I don't know. There's a lot we could do. It all almost feels unnecessary, though. Just put up another blockade. Because if, if we put it up here, we can be aggressive and just smash that like button, you know? Thought we could maybe line up a booger. Because the thing is, even if we do take an, an attack at this point, this... Oh, okay, so we went over there. We got three moves. I'm cool with it. I'm cool with doing all that just to do this. For you be guaranteed. Oh, he's blocked. Wait, what the hell? That was, uh, that was not in, ex uh, excuse me, no, that was not in that column. Advanced! It's alright. It's alright. Now, if that one hit us, then I would be, like, extremely mad. Currently, I'm only kind of mad because it was gonna be a no, a no hit. Let's just... 
let's just set ourselves up for 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 this. I know he could, uh, in theory, just counter. But when you're like not sure if everything's gonna work, <laughs> you just don't don't you know don't count on stupid things when you could just do a guaranteed thing. Becomes a copy of a spell. Rerolls a row. That's that's just so much manipulation. So much manipulation. Who's the real shy gal? Is there a way to know? Is there a way to know? I mean, obviously, we're going to start with that. Hmm. <laughs> it's not like a great way to line these up, but we could obviously just do. I don't love this. So it's a lot of movement for little game, but we need to start doing some poking. Okay, so apparently we were wrong both times there. Destroy a row. We got three whole moves left. Three whole moves left and a destroy a column. I'm intrigued by bringing down some yellow mana. Just don't know that it's gonna. I, that was not the play. That was not the play. Booger you up then for now. Got two moves left though, still. I'll do the. You know what? Generating some black man is actually really solid, so this should be a hit, but then. Resisted. Okay, okay, yeah. Not a problem. Wait, so. Do we know. We know that this one in the middle is is the one. Okay. Well, it ain't. Um, I'd say a poo blockade and a poke. Okay, we got lucky. We got lucky. That's the one. Uh, Reroll the row. Anything that could line up? Oh! Alright, well, we can obviously just do the four damage to you then. Oh, if we could get an. Can we get another one? Can we get another hit off? Anywhere? Anywhere? You can do the bone. We got two moves. Not. Yeah, not with two moves. We can't do the yellow mana. Because that would be obviously the most ideal. I'll do this, though. Get an extra attack off. Spell ready. Destroy a column. Ah, he's trying to get a yellow mana either here or here. And just because I'm scared, I thought that then they would maybe attack. All right. Whomp. Nice try, loser. One, two, three. Remove a tile. Okay. So we have two moves. Is there a way we can... Uh, yeah, we can see if this is the real one or not. Oh, thank God. So we can probably just kill here. Oh my god, of course we can if we crit. Wow. Yeah, this all would be great. If, uh, yeah, I wouldn't have taken a hit. Bigger poops. Kills may heal. Ooh, those are two good ones. Definitely do this. If we get the, uh, if we get the, the coin one, 
I think we would actually be able to roll twice. Uh, oh, an extra move. Pretty big deal. Spell hurt more, spell cost less. Let's do both. Hurt more and hurt more and cost less. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. And we can heal up. This should be this is really like four moves? Is that true? Every turn we get four moves? Is it it's it's just that easy. So these guys here's the big problem. These guys are immune to like everything. Okay. One, two, three, four. <laughs> That's not. We can do one, two, three, four. Hooray! It's not my favorite. We'll generate a little bit. I know that they're immune, but. Oh, look at that. We even got this, anyways. Could get lucky with a crit. Two, two bone attacks. It's totally possible. Totally possible. We do generate the mana as well. Oh, hell yeah. Let's see, we got two moves, two moves, two moves, two moves. Anything that will line up the teeth, we could do this. Oh, oh. If we had an extra mana, we would be good. All right, look, what looks better, this or this? This. Or that. Eh, neither of them look necessarily better than the other. Okay, extra mana. We do get a poke and prod, but we should probably we maybe should have gone for that one so we could uh, poke and prod correctly. Break two columns. We could get lucky. You know? Ah, <laughs> I wanted a booger so bad. I wanted the boog. Okay. We got five mana, so we could do... You know what I'll do? That should be like three boogers, right? No, it's two. So if we do that, and we do that, this guy will move forward, and the other guy won't. So we should be able to kill him. All right. Yeah, we totally can kill him. Real easy. Locks next attack, and attacks is pretty much gonna be crucial, I think. I see all that yellow mana, and I, I do want to mess with it. Hey. <sighs> One, two, three, Not good enough. Not good enough. There's bones up there. It does. I just. I don't know. Want to. Want to get a black tooth or. I guess we'll just do this. Lines up the yellow mana a little bit better anyway. Okay. Just got to make sure I press that button. <laughs> We line up the bones, we could maybe destroy a tile, but to line up the bones, we'd have to do something like that. Uh, obviously, like, like we're going to be fine. We'll do this again. We'll do whomp, followed by whomp, and, uh, yeah, you're going to counter, why not? And if we're gonna counter, I know we should we shouldn't put it down the center, so I guess I'll I'll put it over here. We roll a row. We can do two. So we could even do this. Followed by that. We should kill then. Oh my god, we got just got so many options. So we can destroy a column, we can destroy a row. Uh if we destroy this column. Oh, shoot, that row. I meant to destroy that row. Whoops. It's okay. It doesn't actually matter that much. 
row column row column and this is doesn't destroy it rerolls wow I like the way that looks uh, you know what Whomp. okay we got I mean I feel like just this makes so much sense but at the same time we could just kill save that for uh, a rainier day We got four moves. We could even just do, I don't know. Sometimes you just stun good. Just make a big old chunky, dumb looking move. Why not? One, two. Let me get an extra movement over here. We can't. Okay, we can remove a single tile somewhere. I don't think that's gonna solve it for us anywhere. Let's help it for next turn, I suppose. Three rolls a row. Honestly, I'll just I'll save it. I'm gonna press that just because I I don't know if this guy can actually do his. I thought there's a chance he could do his attack on that turn. All right. Probably shouldn't have done that. We can do this. We can kill the guy up there, and we can easily poke and prod. If these guys were not spell immune, we'd be like this room would be over ages ago. Destroy a column. Unnecessary. Unnecessary. We only needed a, we only needed a five combo instead of a six combo. But who cares? I'm just I'm gonna I want my moves back. I don't wanna I don't wanna look at the board while it's all all grayed out. What a what <laughs> what a problem. We just have the we have the blockade I feel like I just don't want to I don't want to use my brain too hard when we can just you know do this and he'll die next turn and there's no way in hell he'll even hit us I just don't feel like uh, don't feel like we need to do anything fancier we're kind of kind of wrecking pretty darn hard today pretty darn hard I'm excited to see Destroy tile and mana, attack a row. Destroys a tile plus mana. Plus mana. I still don't know exactly what that means. It sounds like destroy a tile and gain mana. Potentially gain the mana that the tile is. But it also could be destroy a tile and destroy mana. Which seems like that can't be right because that'd be awful for the cost of six. All in all, I don't actually want to... I don't want to get rid of anything. I actually am a little... I'm really bummed. It, apparently, the next patch, they're going to make it so you don't have to get rid of every, uh, get rid of stuff if you don't want to. Also, this room is just the worst. You kidding me? This is pretty bad. That is like, that was extremely expensive to do something that didn't need to be that expensive. Get out of here. Was hoping for maybe a crit. I'll take the curse. Destroy a column. Might get lucky. We did get lucky. The three bopper. Clean. Attack a row. I mean, that's a spell, right? <laughs> it's got. It's got to be. At the same time, it'll kill that one. Destroy column. Destroy column. We'll gain an extra move. I know we can't use this as an attack, but. Extra move ain't shabby. We could almost have... 
<laughs> I don't know if there's a way, if we could have broke, if we could put that down and then break these tiles in like a square pattern, we could have a uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. we could have an eight drop. That'd be crazy. We could just set ourselves up for uh, a seven brown drop next turn, which sounds really, really good. Uh, one, two. Okay, well, it's not as clean as I wanted, but you know, it's a it's a bunch of poop. How could it be clean? All right, and then just to check if we can push him backwards, because there's no use for this man otherwise. Maybe if we do enough damage, he'll push backwards. All right. God, I love the blockade. Thank you. Thank you. Super handy. Super handy. Get rid of that guy up there. Thank you. We could even do something like that so we can get a super boogan next turn. I don't know, why mess? Why mess? It's fine. It's fine. And Booger Wave, they should all get, what, three on him? Two? Two? Two Boog on them all? Not bad. All right, so now we can focus pretty heavily on, uh, oops. Actually, no, you know what? No, that's unnecessary. I, I keep doing this. We don't need to do an extra turn so we can do five damage. It's just, it's unnecessary. Because you can just do three. Extra move by doing that. Poke two, we could get an extra brown mana for whatever that's worth. There's so many options. This is going to be like ripe with people <laughs> saying how, how I did the wrong move here, 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 here. Because there's just so many options today. I would, I would love to attack a row. Sure. We should be completely fine. Like, I'm not worried about taking damage here. Just press that in case something is bizarre. One, two, three. This generates a lot of extra mana as well. I feel like let's finally get the uh, flying guy out of here. This is going to break, though, so we should definitely focus on that row next. We got three of these? Good. One. Two. This time we actually do We do need five. Clean. Clean, clean, clean. We probably have it to, uh, to, to get him here. Who knows? No. Oh. Wow. 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 Bumbo the Nimble. Dear God. So we got three moves to work with again. One. Two. There's, there's a better thing to do, I'm sure, but he's got a double blockade in front of him. I'm just not really concerned. Triple blockade. And even if he does attack us, it almost would be nice because it would clean him out quicker. It's just short. There we go. Three damage. Get out of here. You punk. Yeah, de I mean, depending on how the boss goes. Okay. These guys terrify me. They're not, they're not spell immune, though. That's like, that's my favorite, favorite thing to learn. That they ain't spell immune. 
I don't know what these guys actually do, so it terrifies me that they exist. So I'm just going to poke them until hopefully they die. I don't want to use my extra movement. So what happens if we do that? The two, where does the tooth mana go? Okay. It's not bad. Okay, so we could do this and then one more one more hit with a normal thing. I mean, this is really big. Should be this is this five? Five. Clean. Clean. This does four right now. I don't want to waste it on that guy, but. You know what? I won't then. Might have bungled something, but I'm sure we can... Yeah, we can do that. I feel like if we booger one and we do the counter... The odds of a problem seems minimal. What did we get? Come on. Let me get lucky. Ah! Too much, too much. Alright. I... Yeah, we're fine. Okay. Okay. We can do this twice. Correct? Correct. Oh my god. Amazing. Amazing. If you just if you just don't give me spell immune enemies, we're golden. Reduce the cost of your spells, rerolls a random column. I don't really want that. You know, sure. That's our reroll spot. All right. It's the colored flame boy. Boogers, gotcha. This one's obvious. I mean, this one's obviously green. One. Let's just... <laughs> Let's just spend our entire... Oh, I'm so stupid. What was I? I just... I just wanted to see... I just wanted to see... Oh, he also takes damage. That It was dumb. It was dumb. I just wanted to line up a big boy hit, you know? Two. Three. Large hit. To the face. Poke him. Remove a single time. Can we line up anything good? Yeah, if we do this, then we do that. We get to do an extra poke. In fact, we get to do two. He's dead. Yeah. I think it's fine that we took the damage, because look at that. <laughs> we totally did not need to line up all the boogers. I just wanted to. It just I just wanted to. Teeth deal plus one damage. Bones deal plus one damage. I feel like Bones dealing plus one damage is better because it's uh, likely that it'll be a multi-hit. So it should be a net gain of damage overall. Oh my god. That's crazy. Reroll spell cost, spell hurt more, spell charge less. Spell charge less. Doing that every single room is crazy. Spell hurt more. All right. That's wild. To the basement. New zone. Want more trinkets? Play skull game at the wooden nickel. All right, what the hell is up with these guys? They don't have the symbol that shows that they're immune to stuff. So I don't know if I should be worried or not. Reduce the cost of your spell. Wait, what? I kind of want to... If we... If we do... Hear me out. Oh, we're going to take a hit, aren't we? Okay. 
Because this should actually charge up our battery again. So can we reduce the cost again? They're not going... That stuff's not going down anymore. It can't go lower than two, I guess. Well, either way, if these are not spell immune, why are they are spell immune? Why do they... they okay, that's not cool. The, the, they switch. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's not cool. One, two, three. Booger Blast. Brain Blast. Okay, so they got to be bop like this. One. We'll just set up a huge bone attack next turn where the bones will be doing bonus damage. Bones should be doing twice as much. These guys in the front might actually resist, though, after they get hit once. Okay. So currently, I still need to hit him with this, right? Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Gain plus one luck for the room. Heals a heart. Lose one move. I don't want any of this. I can't wait for the patch, the next patch where we can actually skip stuff because I don't want anything. Gain a luck for the room, heals a heart, lose one move. I'm tempted to go for this. And honestly, reducing the cost of the spells almost seems bad because they can't go lower than two. I thought if it could go down to one, it'd be great. The only thing it does is it lowers the cost of destroy column with tile. So I will ditch it. I'll ditch it. Uh. All right. Well, obviously I don't know what they do. They look to be curse related. I'm imagining he's immune until he pops up. Just knowing other Edmund games. We got, we can do a massive poo blockade, just like this. Cover our, cover our rump. Curse. Okay. They do indeed curse. It's fine. Bones deal plus one damage. We got three moves left. We can do one, two. It's fine. That's good enough. It's good enough. I want to do the big bone blast, but two damage is okay. One, two, one. Heals the heart, lose a move. I mean, that that's going to be really handy. Destroy a column of tiles. I'm pretty sure he's going to be immune. Let's try it. Yep. He's immune. Block the next attack. I'm going to press that. I'm just going to press that because I'm worried, you know? Line ourselves up for next turn. There's so much we could do. There's so much that maybe we even should do. There we go. Extra move. Why though? I I don't know. We can we can really really wreck. We don't need an extra poo blockade or anything. I just don't know what to do because I just we don't need to do anything. We're fine. We're good next turn. Like I don't really want to booger him because then he might not do the thing we want him to do. We'll set up a the start of a poo blockade in case we need it. But yeah. He, okay. So yeah, he opens up. He opens up and then we can bop him. That's kind of what I thought. I thought he was like the. I figured he was a host. Educated guess. Boom! Just a lot of curse enemies. Just a lot of curses. Uh, bye bye. Six 
nice mana to play with. Lovely. 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 Blomp. One curse, I know. Probably should have looked at our board before we did that, just in case. Unnecessary. That's not, not what we needed to do there. We could just cons conserve. Actually, we don't need to. We can. Wow. We got extra moves. Whoops. Womp. Oh, you can. They can only. They can only take one damage max. Okay, that's good to know. We'll prep for next time. Minus one move each. Oh, okay. We still have three. That's crazy. Ah, no! I didn't see! I didn't see. All right, so since it's gonna get removed to one anyway. All right. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just not concerned at the moment. Should do what? Two damage? Three damage. Two down to one. And he's dead. It's just this is this is crazy. This is actually crazy. And that's before we do the plus three uh, moves. Teleport to start. Unprime all enemies. I'm not gonna teleport to the start. But I also don't want to switch my items, so I will. I'll take it. I'm not gonna teleport to the start today. Bumbo versus the bygone. Oh man. All right. Well, yes, we're gonna do that. Line it all up for like an extreme overkill amount of uh, of stuff there. Just <laughs> throw down the poop. Do a little poke. What happens when I poke you? A fly. Fair enough. So we can just kill the fly with a one so that we can do bonus damage. A better use of it. Womp. We could even. Uh, oh, I was going to say we could crit and kill. We can't crit and kill right now. Pretty close, though. Destroy a column. I want a bone. Alright. Do we just win? We actually don't want to hit him. Okay. Okay. Don't know what's happening. So I will, uh, I'll actually, I will boog him. I'll boog him a lot. Because he spooks me. Three bugs on the face. Eight damage down to two. You can take a maximum of two, it looks like. Destroy a column. You know what? Oh, shoot. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> we, we, no, we didn't do it. Ladies and gentlemen. We did it. <laughs> Turn one kill? Turn one kill on the final boss. I think we uh, unlocked the next character. And with an extra hard bash, Bumbo crushed that dead boy to must. Finally, Bumbo happy. Now Bumbo can be alone, alone with coin. But Bumbo hears something, something mean, something huge, something. Isaac. Who were you talking to? Where did you get that stuff? I thought I threw it out. He left us, Isaac. He's gone. 
He never loved us. Don't you get it? No, no, Mama, please. Isaac, listen to me. It's just us now. It's just us now, Isaac. You and Mama. Is Bumbo supposed to be Papa? Is that the, the idea? Oh. Everything is terrible. The game is now harder. <laughs> Needle. Unlocked. Brimstone unlocked. Oh, we got unlocks now. Hot diggity. Bumbo, lucky bumbo, some dead bumbo is a bad bumbo. He got coin and bumbo lose coin. He gets it, he loses it. Bumbo, what coin? Bumbo got coin. Oh my god. Oh, bumbo got coin. I love this. Bumbo got coin. This is pro this was probably so much fun to, re to record. <laughs> oh my! Wow! Wow! All right. Well, fantastic. Uh, I don't know if we if that was if we complete quote unquote completed the game or not, and unlocked the uh, the next character. Didn't seem like it. We did. Spells change cost when used. Beat the game twice with all characters. So we got that coin symbol now. I don't know if, uh... Alright. Yeah, there's the one coin down there. That shows that we beat it. Good. That's gonna be... Gonna be nice. Alright, we have a very obvious goal now. Called beating the game twice with all the characters. Very, very obvious goal. So we're gonna... We're gonna get cracking on that. Next episode, we're definitely gonna take on Bumbo the Dead, though. Some, the blue baby variant, spells change cost when used, has three temporary hearts, not even permanent, you can't take, I mean, if we, ha if we had a run as strong as we just had with Bumbo the Dead, then it wouldn't have mattered, because I think we took a total of one damage, we killed most bosses on uh, the first turn, was pretty broken, pretty darn broken, very excited though, glad to see we got some like item unlocks, glad to know that that's in the game. So we're, uh, I imagine we're going to unlock everybody's starting equipment as we, uh, we unlock the needle. I, I imagine as we beat the game, we'll unlock the starting equipment to show up in the pool for other characters, which is great. Especially, like, I really, really want to get the, uh, Bumbo the Weird stuff in there. But for now, next episode, Bumbo the Dead. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more Bumbo. Check out my channel for roguelikes every single day. Thank you, thank you. See you next time. Bye.